joined by Gio. First game at Emirates Stadium. First game actually seeing Arsenal full stop. Yes. What's your reaction? Absolutely amazing. I, and I would come here every single week to watch the Arsenal if it is like this. Absolutely phenomenal. It was really good to watch the guys dominate for 90 minutes to win 2-0 in front of a very happy Arsenal um, support here. It was, was, was absolutely amazing. And then to top it all off, we are above Tottenham again, as it should be in the <laughs> it's table. It's happened again, right? We're in heaven, man. We're absolutely in heaven. And Tottenham, that, that, uh, uh, I have no words. <laughs> have you, no seem, words. you seem elated. Are you going to be as happy at the end of the season? Do you think that Arsenal can maintain that position in third? Yes, without a doubt. In Spanish, you would say sin duda. We, we will we'll definitely um, be, be in the top three by the end of the season. The games, I think uh, Tottenham have at least another top 16 to play before the end of they the play, season. They play City, I think. Yes, they do have City to play and, and, I, and I don't see City um, dropping any points at all to Tottenham. So, uh, in fact, I, I think Tottenham will be in trouble to make it into the top four. Oh, bold claim. Yeah, I, I think, bold I think claim. Man U will be the, in fourth right. and, and I think Arsenal will, will finish third. Man U are on a good run right now. Um, Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has, has, has he recently got the full-time uh, job as, as, as head coach. Yep. Um, they won the first game with him in charge as, as head coach now. And I think they're in a good place. Tottenham, they, they seem to be a little bit shaky. So Gio's at this predictions point. are City or Liverpool first, followed by Arsenal, then United. Uh, it's not City or Liverpool. It's City first, <laughs> Liverpool second, and um, oh, I Arsenal. Johnny third. Mills not going to be happy about that. Uh, that's Johnny Mills' business. <laughs> I speak facts based on based on form right now. Yeah, uh, I think City City are in a better place. Right. There, there's a little bit of what appears to be a little bit of unsettled. There's a bit of unsettledness. Liverpool does seem a bit unsettled. I think Salah is a little bit too selfish um, with, 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 okay. with his playing sometimes. Yesterday, there were, were a few chances clearly where he should have passed to Mane and he doesn't. They still won. They still won. By the skin of their teeth. <laughs> they got lucky, right? By the skin of their teeth. Just, they won. Just, more, just one more final point on Arsenal. This is Emery's first season. Mm -hmm. If in September at the start, I had said to you, look, with our new manager, Arsenal are going to get third place. Maybe Europa League, maybe not. What would you have said in response? We would have taken it. Yeah. Because remember, this is like 95% um, Arsene Wenger's squad. Um, Unai Emery has, has added uh, Lucas Torreira, mm -hmm. Denis Suarez and uh, Matteo Guendouzi pretty much um, on uh, that he brought here. The rest of the squad is still um, Wenger's squad and he has utilised this squad and gotten the best out of them. I mean, we have... We we defeated Manchester United 2-0 here. Tottenham, we, we defeated Tottenham 4-2 here with the same squad essentially that Arsene Wenger has. So he clearly has something about him that he's getting the best out of these players. And we've got our Arsenal back, man. It's the Unai Emery way. Also your first ecstatic. game, is that right? Yeah, yeah. What was the atmosphere like? Um, I mean, I think in the beginning it took us a while to get going. Uh, the Newcastle fans were making a lot of noise. Mm, they do tend to, yeah. Uh, yeah, don't they? And then, uh, you know, we've heard uh, the Emirates branded the British Library before. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I think we disproved that as the game wore on. And, I mean, I, I was absolutely ecstatic. I think I may even have applauded the uh, fourth official announcing the added time. I was just, <laughs> yeah, I just loved every that every minute. Every glorious. minute. The yeah, only, yeah. I guess, downside for some Arsenal fans is that Aaron Ramsey scoring again. Right. Short-term, great. Twice. Long-term, not so much. Twice, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Um, <laughs> but, of course, he's leaving at the end of the season. And, uh, so it's kind of bittersweet, right? It is a bit bittersweet. Also, uh, I don't know if you noticed when he was going off, he went straight down the tunnel. Mm. Could be an injury. Uh, but yeah, I guess either way, you know, it's uh, he was also kind of running the show today, which would make you kind yeah. of worry, maybe. So um, who needs to be brought in to kind of dominate that midfield? Up the ship. Well, I don't think it's going to be Dennis Suarez. No. <laughs> uh, he, had a, he had a start in Dubai or something, but I don't know. We haven't really seen any of him. Um, apparently, like, Ander Herrera is already off the market. So PSG. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And as for, the rest, as for the rest of the squad, because Gio was talking about the fact that this is largely Wenger's, you know, first eleven or, or, right. or, or team. Yeah. H how do you think? Well, will some of them continue into Emery's squad next season, or can you see the likes of Mustafi, for instance? We've heard a lot about the fact that he's <laughs> yeah. not quite up to it necessarily. No, no. I think we saw uh, some instances of uh, Mustafi's uh, issues, <laughs> <laughs> to, say, to, to say the least. To say the very least. Mm. Um, I mean, you know, he does the small things right. You know, he kind of he had some good tackles. Uh, he was tracking back well, but you know, at the same time. Uh, you know, he's not up to scratch. And that said, you know, there were rumours at the beginning of the season that like Lacazette and Aubameyang weren't really Emery's men. I think they proved themselves, you know, um, and then some. You know, I think, you know, they can 
uh, kept themselves safe. Uh, it remains to be seen whether Mesut Ozil has a place next season. I'd be very sad to see him leave. I don't, you know, we saw glimpses of his uh, genius today. 